Cast Highlight is an application diagnostic solution running in SAS. This short demonstration is meant to present some key insights to support IT rationalization initiatives. The Cast Highlight homepage provides a high-level view on the health of the portfolio of applications. In this example, the portfolio is composed of 170 applications that have been analyzed through assessment campaigns. The health factors, as well as the Cloud Ready Index, represent scores in a range of 1 to 100. The higher the score, the better it is. Quick Portfolio Insights are made available to identify the most business critical applications, the applications that require the largest maintenance teams, the most complex applications, and the best candidates to embrace cloud. Let's walk through some examples of insights that represent key catalysts to accelerate your rationalization process. The Business Impact Dashboard plots the applications by using the Y-axis to position the business impact and the X-axis to represent the health factors, which by default is set on software resiliency. Let's start the segmentation exercise with applications that are identified as critical and benefit from great health. We should carry on investing in these applications to make sure that we keep this level of quality. The top left quadrant targets applications that are critical for the business but have a low software resiliency score, increasing risk exposure. These applications could be identified for a reprioritization effort to avoid downtime, which could affect customer experience. The bottom of the quadrant shows applications that are less business critical. This population is generally an interesting segment to envision either replacement, merging, or even retirement of applications. In order to establish a shortlist, we can simply activate the cost dimension by using the number of FTEs to condition the size of the bubble. Let's zoom in on the lowest business impact applications, and to go a deeper level, we switch on the Pareto button to only display the 20% of applications that consume 80% of resources we end up with a target set of applications that are not business critical, cost a lot, and are exposed to short-term risk. IT rationalization is well known for targeting cost optimization in relation to the business value, but this activity should not be only limited to cost. It should also include application complexity. We can identify high complexity using two types of analysis. The risk mapping dashboard offers several options to enable cross-analysis. Let's select the midterm tab to display a bubble chart that mixes software resiliency on the y-axis and elegance on the x-axis. The bottom left quadrant spots the applications that are complex while being difficult to maintain or transfer. If these applications also require the largest number of resources or FTEs, this segment of applications are perfect candidates to be sunset or merged. As mentioned previously, the IT rationalization process aims at reducing cost and complexity to constantly optimize the cost-benefit ratio of your portfolio of applications. Let's transition to another type of complexity which is a huge burden for most IT departments, the identification of duplicate and overlapping applications. From the application category dashboard, we can identify the applications according to their business impact via the y-axis, their health via their color, their typology via the x-axis. Please note that the x-axis can leverage survey questions to classify the applications. For instance, are they in line with enterprise standards, or do they comply with specific regulations, etc. In this case, we can quickly inventory all the applications that belong to a given application type like asset management operations. Among these applications, some are custom applications, others are commercial off-the-shelf applications, or customized COTS. This dashboard consolidates overlapping applications that may provide similar or same capabilities. By analyzing their health and cost, we can spot the best candidates for merger or retirement. Although Cast Highlight offers several predefined dashboards and insights, it may be necessary to execute a multi-criteria query to build a specific segment from the application's results dashboard. For instance, we may want to identify the applications with the largest maintenance team, the lowest business impact, and the lowest software resiliency. We can use this reduced segment as a baseline to trigger recommendations using the export PowerPoint output. In addition to baselining and setting objectives, users should leverage Cast Highlight to track progress over time. The Trends dashboard enables users to monitor the evolution of application health in value or in variation, and it's applicable to all the health factors, sizing, technical debt, cloud readiness, as well as the maintenance effort. For more information, please visit casthighlight.com.